Hi, this is Christine. And for today, we are going to discuss the case of Corpus versus Santo Tomas, GR number 186571, promulgated August 11, 2010. The facts of the case. Corpus, a naturalized Canadian citizen, married Santo Tomas in Canada. After the celebration of their marriage, Santo Tomas went back to the Philippines for work purposes. Corpus followed his wife in the Philippines. However, he was shocked when he discovered that Santo Tomas is having an affair with another man. Upon his arrival back in Canada, he immediately filed a divorce against his wife. After two years, Corpus met another Filipina and decided to remarry. He immediately fixed his divorce decree with Santo Tomas back in the Philippines. However, NSO informed him that his marriage with Santo Tomas still subsists under the Philippine law. And to be enforceable, the foreign divorce decree must be first be judicially recognized by the Philippine court. The issue, whether or not Article 26, Section 2, grants foreigner the right to institute a judicial recognition of a foreign divorce decree. The ruling. The court held that alien spouses cannot claim the right as it is only in favor of Filipino spouses. The legislative intent of Article 26 is for the benefit of the clarification of the marital status of the Filipino spouse. However, aliens are not stripped to petition to the RTC for his foreign divorce decree as it is a conclusive presumption of evidence of the authenticity of foreign divorce decree with conformity to the alien's national law. Thus, the court granted the petition of corpus and reversed the decision of RTC, which they found that Pasig has just acted out of line.